Hey, okay, everyone. Right, so <clears throat> recently I was like kind of thinking that um, I wanted to go back into education, do you know? Like, all my life I've basically been at college or university and stuff, you know? And it's only recently that like I got my degree and I was like, okay, well, I, like, I want to go back and do something else, learn something else, something totally different, do you know what I mean? So I did politics, philosophy and economics, and that's like basically what I've been studying for years and years and years, building up to this degree. I want to do something different. I want to go learn something. So I've got the local college's like prospectus thing um, to like have a look at sort of what else you could do. So I was thinking I might do photography or something. Um, I work in photography. Like my dad, that used to teach photography at university, was him who taught me how to be a photographer. And that's basically my job, a photographer, but I've got no qualifications in it. You know what I mean? It's basically word of mouth, like the people who like employ well basically to be fair, like the people who I'm employed by it's basically my mate. You know what I mean? He like runs a theatre company and I basically work for him. But all of my work is basically done by through word of mouth. They've seen my portfolio and then I get jobs. But I haven't actually got any formal qualifications in it, do you know what I mean? So I thought maybe I could do that. And then I was looking around and I saw music and I was like, oh my God, music, do you know? Music's something that I've been involved in like basically all my life, really, do you know? From... From being a child, I've been involved in like operatic societies and opera and singing on stage and stuff. Do you know what I mean? Like I've performed in front of three or four thousand people on stage, you know, and su and sung. I remember I did um, I had the part Prince Chung Alung Ka in like The King and I. And basically, I had to go be on stage on my own, nobody else, solo, and sing this song in front of 4,000 people, do you know what I mean? So I've done, like, loads of performance stuff. And then, like, for, like, eight years, I used to put on raves around Yorkshire and stuff. And I used to do DJing. I used to DJ at these raves, which is also kind of music. And then later on, I learned how to play the guitar. And I basically learned the, how to play the guitar so that I had something to sing along to because I'm basically a singer, do you know what I mean? That's what I got trained to do. I got classically trained to be a singer. And so I used to, I got learned the guitar and to sing along. And I've been to loads of like open mic events and other like festivals and stuff where I've sung. I've been paid to sing, do you know what I mean? I've, had, I've done professional productions and stuff. So I have actually had some connection with the music industry do you know what i mean on a fairly kind of localish level but i have been involved with the music industry for, throughout my life so i thought it might be nice to go learn music like properly formally like i don't know how to read music so that might be something to learn i don't know i, I, I basically i'd love to learn how to play the piano as my main objective in music is to learn how to play the piano because I can't play the piano and I really, really would love to learn how to do that. So, so anyway, I was like, okay, music sounds like something that I might be, might be quite interesting for me to go and learn how to do. So, so I went to the college and I basically um, went and had a look on the website and stuff and there was like a, a telephone number to talk to the to like the people from the music department yeah so basically i rang them up and then they wanted me to like email them so basically i got into this like email conversation with one of the guys there and he was basically sort of asking me what do you want to learn what do you want to do do you know what i mean what, what do you want out of this thing that you wanted to study and so i got into conversation with him and he was like yeah okay that kind of sounds like our hnd technology and production of course that's how you, what you're talking about seems to be that's what we're teaching that this is i'll put you into contact with the guy from there right 
So I was like, all right, cool, cool, right. So then I went and had a look on the website for it, yeah. And so it turns out that um, um, this HND course is a level four course, whatever that means, right. And it basically said, like, you need to have at least level three to be able to get onto this level four course, yeah. And it said, basically... You have to have an interview, and you have to pass the interview before you can get onto this course, right? So anyway, this guy put me in touch with the guy who runs this course, and he basically rang me up today, and that was this was the interview, yeah? Um, and I had to pass this interview before I could get onto the course, right? Anyway, this interview just went amazing, right? Me and this guy just got on amazingly, amazingly, right? We are just talking about music and stuff. And he was like, tell, you know, he says like, basically like, what's your experience in music then? And so I told him, like, whatever, I used to be in operatics, I've like sung in front of thousands of people and I've uh, played the guitar in front of loads of people. I've been, I've been involved in like performance stuff. You know what I mean? I've done loads of stuff like that. And he's like, well, whatever, you've got more than enough experience, much more than most of our students have before they come here. So that's pretty cool. He's right, so basically, this is a level four course. So like, what, what kind of education have you got? I was like, but mate, I've got a degree. He's like, oh, you've got a degree? I'm like, yeah, I've got a degree in politics, philosophy and economics. He's like, oh, whatever, then you've got more than enough qualifications for it. So basically like those little hoops that I had to jump through, yeah, whatever. You've got more than enough experience, you know, more than most of our students and whatever your educational qualities are like much higher than what you need to hear. So then we just basically sat and talked about music for like basically an hour and a half we were on the phone. And he was telling me like what they do within the course and stuff. All the different aspects. And I was saying, look, what well, basically I want to learn how to play piano. He's like, yeah, whatever. We've got somebody here who can teach you piano, not a problem. It's like for one of, for part of the course you have to do this keyboard thing, so you're gonna have to learn how to use the piano anyhow, and we you know you'll you'll learn how to do it. I was like, whatever, that's awesome. That's what I want to do. And he's like, we do like performances and stuff. He says, um, to be honest, one of the one of the things that we're always looking for is singers. He says we generally have people who can play instruments, but not very many people who can sing. So do you know what I mean? Like as a singer, you'll you you you'll you'll find something that you can do, and this will be pretty good for you. I was like, that's pretty awesome. But to be honest, like the whole breadth of things that they do within this course just sounds awesome. There's loads of things that I've never even considered before. Do you know what I mean? And it's talking about like so one of the things you go and you have to like find like a natural sound, so it might be like a bird singing or a train going or something, something out in the natural environment. So you have to go and record. And then bring it into the studio and play around with it and like whatever create something. That sounds like that sounds pretty fucking awesome. And then it was like basically also you have to learn how to compose like classical music, you know, like operas and stuff like this, and like proper like formal classical music. You you're gonna learn how to do that. I was like that sounds amazing. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? I've always loved classical music. It's like my dad was always, like, every time I came around to my dad's house, he was always playing some kind of classical music. Do you know what I mean? Be like, hey, here's some Wagner, here's some Bach. Whatever, so I had to listen to this shit all the time anyhow, right? And I quite like classical music anyhow, because of my dad. So, like, learning how to do it on a formal structure, that sounds pretty awesome to me. It sounds pretty awesome. So basically, we talked for ages, and then, like, at one point, I was, in, I was like, oh, yeah, I didn't even mention that. I used to put on raves. It's like, you used to put on raves? Like, yeah. We get talking. Turns out, right, me and this guy know one another, right? From from the days when I used to put on raves, he used to come to our raves. He knows me. He's like, I know you've got dreadlocks, haven't you? I'm like, yeah. He's like, I know you. I know you. You used to wear a T-shirt, circle day, fuck authority. I'm like, yeah. He's like, I know you. I know you. I'm like, oh, my God, that's mental. That's mental. So this guy knows me from when I used to put on raves. Crazy, right? So like, so like, he's like, whatever, whatever, right? Whatever is like, you can join. You know what I mean? You can, you can sign up for this course. You've got more than enough knowledge. You've got more than enough experience and stuff. And do you know what I mean? You sound like you'd really enjoy it and stuff. And he even said, "I wish most of our students were like you," <laughs> which is kind of cool. 
So, so yeah, so I've gone through the hoops and stuff. Basically, he sent me the application form out, so I just have to send the application form in, and it sounds like everything's gonna be everything's gonna be awesome, and I'm gonna get onto this course. So, so I'm really looking forward to that. That sounds like it's gonna be something I'm really, really gonna enjoy. And it's gonna be good to be get back into education and expand my mind and expand my knowledge and stuff. So, yeah, everything's looking good. Everything's looking good. I'm gonna learn music at a proper formal level. So yeah, I'm looking forward to it.